Good day. Will you please say something about yourself? Uh, good day. I'm Bardi Amwada. I'm 27 years old. I'm single. Uh, I graduated uh, college as a uh, nursing aide. So where do you live? I live in uh, Mindanao, okay. uh, South Cotabato, Philippines. Okay. Tell me about your working experience. Uh, my first work, I worked as a clinic aide. Aid as a um, clinic aid. My work there is to taking care of the baby and also the delivery mother. Okay. The baby for uh, the mother to deliver their baby. Like that. So how many years did you work as a as a nursing aid? I worked there as uh, for almost three years. Okay. So after that, do you still do you have another job experience? Yes. I after I. I finished there. I worked abroad in Kuwait. For how many years? Uh, I worked there as for almost two years. So what is the nature of your job in Kuwait? Uh, nature? Yes. Uh, uh, did you work as a domestic helper? Uh, as a uh, adult caregiver and uh -huh. also I am also working in the house. Okay, so how old were the uh, elderly oh. did you take care? Uh, she is 68 years old. Okay, so how, how did you take care of her? I give medicine, I take bath, uh, I change the diaper, I give medicine. I give also insulin injection so I can, and I make exercise for him. Okay, so you said you also perform household chores. So what kind of household chores? I, I clean, I make iron, I wash, I cook also. Okay, so how many persons did you serve? Uh, I serve in, I serve, serve four persons in the house. Okay, so were you the only helper? No, they have, they are four, they are four workers. Okay, so how big is your employer's house? What? How big is your employer's house? Uh, big, big, big. I can't explain, but <laughs> with how many stories? Uh, four, four stories. With how many rooms? How many rooms? Uh, I will count one, two. Okay, so a lot of rooms. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I added the rooms. Do they have a? Do they have a garage? Yes. Uh, prayer room. How many prayer rooms do they have? Uh, two prayer rooms. One for the boy and one for the girls. Okay, so do you have any allergies like in pets, detergents, or foods? Yes, I have. You have an allergy? Yes, I have um, sometimes in air. It's depending upon the what's that, um, season. Like that. Okay. Sometimes in cold or in food also, just like the seafood or egg. Okay, so uh, do you know how to take care of a newly born baby? Yes, I know how to take care of the baby. So, how will you take care of them? Uh, I change the diaper, I feed them, um, uh, I take them to go to sleep. Okay. So, what will you do if your employer's baby is crying? Um, I, will, I, ch I will check the baby if maybe she is hung hungry or the diaper is wet or full what, of what if the baby is still crying? What do you do? Uh, I will inform the I will inform my employer to that the baby is still crying. Okay, so do you know how to sing children's songs? Yes. Can you sing a sample? Okay. One little two little three little nine little four little five little six little nine little seven little eight little nine little nine little ten little nine little boy. Okay, thank you. Thank you. So mostly in Hong Kong, the maids do the marketing. So are you willing to do it? Yes, madam. I am willing to do the marketing. Did you also do marketing in Kuwait? Uh, no, madam. Only here in the Philippines. Okay, so do you, do you know how to cook? Yes, ma'am. What yeah. kind of food? Uh, Filipino food. Can you give me a sample? Uh, just like adobo, uh, apitada, okay, uh, so. sinigang. How about Arabic food? Arabic food. Uh, legal on. Okay, so how about simple Chinese dishes? Uh, fried, uh, fried vegetables, fried rice. Okay. okay, so can you operate electrical appliances? Yes. 
What kind of appliances? Uh, washing machine, uh, vacuum. Okay, so most of the employers in Hong Kong speak Cantonese, so are you willing to learn their language? Yes, ma'am. I am willing to learn the language. Okay. So, is it okay with you if your day off is during weekdays? Uh, it's okay, ma'am. It's okay. It's depend upon the employer. Okay. So, why did you choose to work in Hong Kong? Uh, it's because I know that Hong Kong have a high salary. And also, I can help also my parents or to to bring uh, to send my brother and sister in their education. Okay. So, would you like to say something to your prospective employer? Um, Good day, sir and madam. Uh, please give me an opportunity to serve your family. Uh, I promise to I, pr I promise to serve you and your family uh, with respect and care. Uh, I will also promise to to be loyal and to do my duties and responsibilities. So, are you going to finish your contract? Yes, ma'am. I am willing to finish the contract and also if you want to continue my my service with you, I am also willing to. Okay, thank you.